Flies aren't harmful, but they can show be annoying and unpleasant. Especially if they've invaded your home. If you want to keep flies away from you and your room and home, then you have to take some steps to fly-proof your home. Take some preventative measures, and even create a few convenient fly traps. If you want to know how to keep flies away from you and your room, just follow these steps. So, we are going to watch about the how to keep flies away from you and your room. Method 1. Trapping or killing the flies. First is use fly paper. If you really have a fly problem, put fly paper in your room to keep the flies away. Though it won't look pretty, it will definitely get the job done. Hang it in the sunshine and away from any wind for it to be most effective. Step 2 Use Fly Traps Place fly traps outside your window or out in your yard to catch the pesky creatures. Don't install them in your room. Though, they can be quite smelly and the odor will quickly overwhelm your abode. Step 3 Hang clear plastic bags half filled with water near your doors and windows. The water in the bags will reflect light and will make the flies become disoriented and unable to enter your home. Step 4 Take advantage of your spiders. If you've noticed a spider or two in the corner of your room or hanging from the ceiling near your window, live and let live. As long as the spiders aren't dangerous. They will help kill flies and keep you and your room safe from these pesky creatures. The next time you see a spider in your room, ask yourself if you really need to kill it. Finally, use a fly swatter. If you see fly, you can use the swatter to put it out of its misery. Just position the head of the swatter over the fly and use your wrist to flick the swatter over the insect. Though it's not a good long-term solution, it'll work great if a fly approaches you. Or if you see a fly coming into your room without being invited. Method 2. Adjusting your environment. First is close your windows and doors. If you want to keep flies away from you and your room, then you should close your windows and doors, which can let in the flies. If you have a screen over your window or door, then you can leave that open, as long as it doesn't have any cracks or holes in it. If a fly has bust into your room, then open your door or window until it flies out. And then shut it again. Step 2 Keep food away from the flies. If you keep food in your room or in the kitchen, you should keep it covered to protect it from the flies. Flies love the smell or a sweet or hearty meal and will try to get close to your food as much as they can. Here are some ways to cover your food. Once you've cooked a meal, Put away any extra cooking ingredients or extra servings before you start eating. Or they will attract flies. When you're done eating, wash your dishes right away to keep any food particles from attracting the flies. If you're putting food away, make sure all of the containers are tightly sealed. Obviously, fruit flies love overripe fruit or produce. Don't leave your fruit out in the open, cover it with a muslin cloth bag. Step 3 Take special care to keep meat away from flies. Flies especially love the smell of cooked meat. If you are cooking meat, make sure to put away any leftovers and to wash your dishes when you're done. If you need to leave the door open while you cook the meat, have a fan blowing at the open door, this will scare the flies away. If you're having an outdoor barbecue, make sure to keep your doors and windows closed. Step 4 Scoop your pet's poop. If you have a cat and the litter box is in your room or home, make sure to scoop it at least once a day and to throw out the remains in a dumpster or outdoor. Trash can to keep the flies from your home. If you have a dog, make sure to throw his poop out in a closed container, which is also preferably outside your home. If you have a yard, try to keep your dog from pooping in the yard, or that will attract more flies. Step 5 Tighten your trash cans. Make sure the lids are firmly placed on the trash cans in your room. And that they have an outer bag to keep food or other particles from sticking to the inside of a trash can. This can help keep flies away from your environment. Make sure that your trash is properly bagged. 2. Finally, drain any extra water from your room. Flies love moisture, so make sure not to leave a puddle of water in your room after you take a shower or to leave wet gym clothes lying in a heap on your floor. Don't leave open containers or water out and try to keep water from collecting in your room. 
or you and your room will attract more flies. Method 3. Taking preventative measures. First is check your home for leaks. Sealing up your room will help you save energy and to keep flies away. Check the weather stripping and parking around your windows and doors to make sure it doesn't have cracks in it. And replace it if it's necessary. Check for leaks in any pipe entryways, like in your air conditioning unit. Fill any gaps you find with a can of expandable foam. Step 2. Replace any broken screens on windows or doors. Check your screens for holes or tears, even if they're tiny. They may still be big enough to let in flies. Replace them, or cover them with tape for a temporary solution, and see what a difference it makes. Make sure that the edges of the screens fit snugly and that there's no space for the flies to pass through. Step 3. Use plants or herbs to repel the flies. There are many herbs and plants that repel flies. So consider setting up a mini garden in your room and see how much it scares off the pesky flies. Here are some plants and herbs that will help you keep flies away. Basil. Grow a basil plant outside, near your room, and watch it keep out the flies. It will not only deter flies, but it will deter mosquitoes as well. And it can make a great addition to any meal. Bay leaf. You can grow it outside during the summer. But you should bring the plant indoors during the winter to scare off the flies. You can also just put a bowl of dried bay leaves in your room to keep the flies out. Lavender. Not only does lavender smell delicious, but it will scare off the flies. You can grind it into a powder and sprinkle it over your furniture. Grow it in a container. Or grow it in your kitchen garden. Mint. Place a mint plant in your room and scare away fleas, ants, and flies. Tansy. Tansy is another herb that is known from repelling flies, ants, fleas, and moths. Step 4. Get a dog. Dogs are not only cute and lovable, but they love eating flies. Consider getting a dog to not only add some fun to your life, but to get rid of those pesky flies. Finally, get a cat. Cats are cuddly, cute, and they love batting and fighting off flies. A bonus, it's absolutely adorable when cats try to fight flies. We hope it is useful to you. Please subscribe to our channel to upskill yourself.